but it's no match for this bitter cold. I also need to start recording. So I almost forgot. For journey, I guess. Um, but yeah, I think we were heading, or I think there was another section back this way, like back out near the, like the beach area that we didn't go to because I thought that that was the correct way. But I think this might actually be the correct way. It's really hard to tell because there's no freaking map to tell you where to go. Or like where you, sh which way is the wrong way. Again, not you can't just teleport back and go to the other areas, but I tried, I like to try to go the wrong way first so that I can, you know, just do it first and not have to worry about it. But I think we have to just like pick a direction here and just go. And hope it's the wrong way. Um It has been way too long since I played this. I am like rusty as all shit. Okay, he's good, he's dead. You can move on. Forgetting what the buttons are. <laughs> It'll come back to me eventually. Enhanced. Tiger subduing pellets. Oh, I mean, can I make those now then? Upon use, considerably increases damage for a long duration. Now, can I see how to make it? Combat wisdom? No. That's just combat. Uh, meditation spot. Guess I won't know until I go to a crafting location. I guess maybe let me go try. Oh, what is this? Oh, meditation point. Holy shit, I almost missed that. That would have been bad. Oh yeah, I can skip this. My bad. Sorry. Oh. I have four points to spend. Well, shit. Uh, let me do that really quick. Now, what the frig do I want to put it into? There are so many points. Defense, max mana. Stamina recovery rate or attack. Oh. I don't mind that. Uh, what does this do? When below one focus point, you can still perform varied combos, but with significantly reduced damage. Mm. Oh, this is the resolve thing, right? Considerably increases damage reduction upon a charged heavy attack. Oh. Forgot about that. So the more focus points I use, I think, the more damage reduction you get. Oh yeah, hmm. When charging, perfect dodges retain any focus that has been built up. Oh. That could be good. What was this again? Ah. Which I've already unlocked. After seeing through the enemy, Skyfall Strike does more damage. Oh yeah, I can do Skyfall Strike, right? Oh yeah, I have to hit Y again. But I'm never in Smash Dance much anymore. I'm usually in Thrust Dance, aren't I? 
I should probably level this up, honestly. Because I really like the this stance the best, I think. So let's put some points into this. Uh, following rolling thrust with heavy attack unleashes a tactical retreat. Meh. Staggered or repelled enemies take increased damage from a uh, damage from charged thrust heavy attacks. Hmm. When you have four focus points, automatically perform a thrust heavy attack immediately after a roll dodge or a perfect dodge. Oh, that's convenient. Probably should have actually looked at other things in here, but oh well. Uh, I probably should have maxed this out, actually. I don't know if it really matters, but... Oh, I should have leveled this up, actually. Oh, shit. God, there's so many different things. Okay, sorry. I keep getting sidetracked with shit, but that's just me. That's just who I am. Um, slowly grants focus. Eh. Moderately increases critical hit chance. Oh, that could be good. All right, let's put those there. Uh, so the enhanced ones are up. I'm going to have to use the bottom ones first. The right one is damage reduction and amplification pellets. I just read it and I already forgot because my memory is shit. Okay, um, let me go see what it takes to craft. I want to see what it takes to craft those um, enhanced pellet things, if we even can craft them. Uh, is it make medicines? Ah, okay, so it takes monkey head fungus. Oh god, where the hell did I get that from? I do not remember. I can only make three of them, though. Maybe I should just make three of them. Because I can. I will probably need them. Uh, maximum health, stamina... That's for damage reduction. I only have one. Let me craft a couple of these. Store, can I buy anything of use? Hmm. Eh. I already have some of those and some of that. Okay, great. Um, I can sell some stuff. Beautiful. All right. I think we are good here. I don't think I want to craft any weapons, right? I haven't unlocked this yet. Oh, I do have the stuff for this if I really wanted to craft it. But... Eh? I feel like this upgrade is just going to be much more significant. Armor. Is there anything new? I'm crashing. Oh, yeah, I'm still wearing this. Oh, my God. Oh, wait a minute. No, I was wearing this for some reason, right? No. I don't know. It's a four piece that I'm not wearing. Oh, I haven't crafted this yet. <laughs> oh, wait, what am I... How do I change my armor? Is that just in my regular inventory slots? Ah, okay. 
Now I guess it is the best thing that I can wear. Never mind. Uh, Vengeful Mirage will inflict Thunderbane. I don't think I'm doing any thunder damage, though. That's the only problem. <laughs> uh... Oh, wait a minute. This does give me more... We're just going to leave it the way it is for right now. Wish you could upgrade the armor that you get. It is kind of a dagger. I'm not going to lie. Or maybe I'm just too stupid and don't understand that you can. Is there somebody who would upgrade your armor? I don't remember. It's part of the problem with... um Going so long in between uh, playing. <laughs> I don't remember shit. Anywho, let's continue. We can always fast travel if we want to go backwards. So we're going to proceed forward here. Whoa, Jesus Christ, you just teleported out of nowhere. This is, um, hi. Okay, well, he was very easy to kill. Much easier than I thought he was going to be. Assuming we can't go out here. Nope. All right. remember who we are go trying to find or what we're trying to find oh, I hate you oh I just level up too. Also, he was not as bad as I remember them being. <laughs> I guess he was just kind of getting stunned over and over again too, which was great. Red-haired Yaksha. I'm going to get backstory on him now? Nope. I think I already have, actually. This looks like a boss fight. I need a rest. <laughs> That pavilion looks like a good place. Wait, is that the... Goddamn bug. Get out of my face. Uh, I think that's the old man from the first area. That's what it looks like. All right. Um, Well, let's just go in here. Fuck it. This is definitely going to be a uh, boss fight here. That's for certain. Or at least I think so. Hmm.
Not very much in here right now. Boosh. Would you stop teleporting around and making freaking jumpy sounds? You're scaring me. Oh, there he is. I was like, where'd he go? Aged ginseng. I'm supposed to go talk to that dude first, but whatever. We'll gather all these materials first. Then we'll go talk to his ass. Uh-huh. Ooh. Ooh, there's some enemies up here. He came out of nowhere. Uh, found treasure. Let me have a look. Hell no. You ain't taking my shit. That is unacceptable. What do we got here? A tree pearl. You are taking way too long to kill that thing. Hmm. So we've like completely bypassed that section of the story, it seems. At least for right now. I'm assuming I can't go up to this temple area. Nope. Hmm. So maybe there's something else up here that we're going to be able to do once we go and talk to him? Guess we'll find out. Can I shortcut my way back down? Of course not. That would have been too convenient. Really? Come on. Ooh. Genshin. Wee. All right, buddy boy. What are you going to tell me? Conversation we're going to have here. Oi, kid. You look suspicious. Oh, it's what not the old man. What kind are you? Shh. I'm looking at that Buddha over there. It's the Buddha kid. See his belly button? It's so big. <laughs> me and you, we look way smaller. Buddha? Where is it? You see no Buddha because you think no Buddha. <laughs> <laughs> no thought, no sight. I, the sacred Gorman, saw enough Buddhas before you were born. Foolish brat. You didn't see that coming, did you? <laughs> True hearts find their path, and the Buddha is on that path. Why not worship with a true heart? The path might just show itself. Worship my hoof. Visit temples, kneel to figures. You tell no black from white. That's my master. I am fed up with all these skin-deep rites. <laughs> <laughs> no true heart, the path is sealed. With true heart, it's revealed. What? Oh, he's healing me. Thanks. 
Thanks for the free healing. I'll take it. Okay, what do you got to say to me then? No, this won't do. I can't help you before you have that in you. Visit each temple you encounter and worship every Buddha you see. Or the true face of Buddha will always remain elusive to your eyes. Ah. Why the rush? Try looking around to see a Buddha. One must hold the Buddha in one's heart. Okay, so I need to go back to the top where I just was, I think. Time to do a little bit of running around. I wonder if any, any more enemies are going to spawn now that I've advanced the storyline. Even though I've already, like, murdered all of the ones along the way. Is it this one? get it what am I supposed to do maybe this is the progression forward area then and this isn't the correct way um okay Something here. Oh. Hmm. Guess I don't know which way I'm supposed to be going then. Maybe this is the right way then. Blast it! We're meant to be doing some worshipping! Did you see any Buddha? I can see one now. that boy said. Ah, there must be four Buddhas to worship. <laughs> Loony monk. God <laughs> reason with him. Okay, so there's... That's one. So are they hidden throughout this entire area? Or is it just down this way? Boy! That's what you get. Oh, hey. Just go through the motions, boy. <laughs> Who knows if it's true or not? That little monk was speaking riddles. <laughs> of course he was. He's Buddha. Or a Buddha, I should say. Wow, I didn't kill it. Mm-hmm.
And here's the third Buddha. Assuming the fourth Buddha is going to be more of a fight. <clears throat> Back when we journeyed to the New West, our master took it from Mount Lingshan. He visited and kneeled to every figure until Yellowbrow captured him. Uh, I'm not my master. <laughs> it's dark in here. Hi. Oh, he dead. Okay. Yay, resolute strike coming in clutch. Yo, what's up, people? I see we have some new viewers. How's your evening or day or wherever time it is for you going? Hopefully it's been good. And, aw, I want to get the last hit, you stupid idiot. All right, let's go find this last Buddha. Again. One more trick from my rake. Oh, you're you, you dead, boy. Oh god. Oh. Oh. Get wrecked. Uh oh, here's the last Buddha. Fantastic. What's that sound? That little mug sucks his drinks <laughs> once more. Worship my hoof. Let's go back. <laughs> uh, no, it definitely probably worked. What did we open up, I wonder? Probably a doorway of some sort. Uh, okay. Let's go get this little money. And then we'll hop back up here. Buddha. Buddy. What we got going on? What did we unlock? Oh, of course I have to go all the way around. Damn it. Chubby one. We've done the rights. Where's the path? Chubby one. <laughs> the path? Isn't it always there? Uh, it's not always there. Don't you trick me, you bald, <laughs> pot-bellied brat. He or can't I see it, but we probably can. Path at all. He sees wisely with faith. You are daft without it. Yeah. Cut your nonsense. Oh, you must be that trickster himself, fooling us all along. <laughs> Take my rake. And gone. <laughs> Why so rude? Brat, save your stupid path. <gasps> oh I'll no! On myself. You go on first. I'll meet you at the summit. Crap! My bad. Sorry. Totally forgot I had it. Didn't have it on um the first one. Can you hear me now? My bad. Shit. It's gonna be muted, I guess, for the first like forty minutes of my recording. Damn it. <laughs> Fuck. Hopefully you can hear me now. I've been talking in silence this whole time. Shit. Alright, I gotta go back up around, I guess. 
Well, how are you doing, Anthony? How's your day going, evening, or whatever time it is for you? <laughs> yeah, it does, yeah. Happens to me more frequently than it should, probably, with how many t how much I've been recording recently. I still forget to unmute shit or whatever. Put it on the correct recording track. Alright. What did we open up up here? Nothing? Am I crazy? Huh? Oh. Right here. Never mind. Oh, interesting. It's a tiny little hole. Damn. Okay. Man, I just love all the little areas in this game. And they're so well done. This is a super cool area. What? Oh, must be the next save location. Oh. Damn. <clears throat> Ooh, that's stuttering. really need to rest up. Still got full stuff. Um, guess we're good. Is that the monkey that I hear? I forget who makes that sound. I feel like it's the monkey though. Oh, it definitely is a monkey. I think I just saw him out of the corner of the screen up there. <laughs> oh. The face of the destined one. It will fit me just as well. Creepy. Who the hell are you? We're not gonna get a name. Non-white. Oh. Oh. He he blocks. Okay. He's the first one that I've seen that's blocked. Ooh. Oh, wrong button. Shit. Oh, I can't freeze him. Well, that sucks. Ah, fuck. Well, they're taking care of him for me. <laughs> you know what, let's just transform, why not? Ah! Oh my god. Oh, he's on fire now. Jesus. Oh. What happened? 
What the fuck was that? Oh, okay. Interesting. He ran away. How wonderful. That was a semi-intense battle. Any of you real? Don't look like it. Man. Oh, hello. Ow. Oh, there's two of you. Oh. And you're dead. So dark in some of these areas, damn. Ooh, flowers. take you out first and then now you oh you have a ranged weapon but you were too slow uh, oh that was a little overkill I guess but oh well oh chest Betraya's orb. It's a curio. What does the curios do again? Land enough successful hits on the enemy to avoid the next fatal blow. I mean, that sounds pretty good. But... I like what I'm currently wearing right now. Maybe we'll try it out at some point. Ooh. Oh, thought I was gonna like fall to my death for a second there. I don't even know if you can fall down there. Half the time you can't fall down in sections where. Nope, definitely can't fall down there. Okay. Look at this view. Fantastic. Go down here? No. So many areas I can't go to. Oh, here we go. Boss fight continuation. Hey, meditation point. Oh, God. Oh, I can't use it again. Ah! Come here, buddy. Ah. Ah. Damn it. Ah, dodging too fast. Jesus Christ. Okay. Ah. 
Uh, it's been too many days since I played this. I'm dodging way too much or way too bad. Oh god. Ah, god damn it. Oh my god. Ah, fuck. <laughs> Change the lead. Holy fuck. Oh. Oh, I've been chilled. Oh, my fucking god. God. Oh my god. Fucking hell. I think I'm out of healing too. Yep, I'm out of healing. Okay, I'm done. Oh, fuck. Damn. Okay, this fight's a little insane. I think I need some poison resistant shit. Oh, I'm gonna have to do this all again. Fuck. Um. All right, um, brew? Oh, yeah. Oh, medicines, here we go. That increases damage. Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, I have three of them. It's probably fine. Wait, did he do chilled stuff too? I think he did. Health and stamina, meh. Okay, I have the anti-whatever stuff. Let me just equip it really quick. I think that's what he was doing, poison damage. For the most part. Okay, I don't have to redo the fight. I just have to continue on to the next area then. I mean, I guess the good thing is, is that my mana is restored. But I don't think I can actually freeze him, though. 
I'm just gonna run by you guys because I don't care. I guess I do have to. Oh god. Oh god. Man, they move so slow. Alright. What stance do I want to use to fight this guy? I feel like I kind of need to use... Uh... Whatever the frig this first stance is. And maybe the second stance? I could try using the pole one, I guess. But I don't know. Really hard to tell. Ah, uh, fuck. Okay. Ah. Okay, I can't even do damage to you half the fucking time. It's really obnoxious. Ah, fucking hell. Son of a bitch. Ooh. Oh, whoops, wrong one. managed to do that. Uh. Mmm, son of a bitch. Fuck. Okay. Well, we're gonna be here for a while, I think. Keep dodging too fast is my main problem. Over dodging. I think that's the same monkey. Can I get to him somehow? Must be able to, I just don't see a way. 
to do that right this second. It's a free 213 experience every time, but it's going to get real old for you to watch. understand how I'm supposed to damage this dude because he seems to take no damage because he just blocks all of my shit constantly. Hmm. Uh, doesn't seem to take... I don't know. Do I get my, my things back if I die? It seems like I might. Uh, he does ice and... Oh, fucking hell. Fucking hell. Jesus. To lead the stage. Okay. So he does both frost and fucking poison shit. Well, that's annoying. Mindfulness cliff. Well, not being very fucking mindful, apparently. Um... Make medicines. I also need damage reduction. Where the fuck is the damage reduction? It's just this one, right? Okay, let's make a few of those. Uh, instantly removes chill. Okay, I need this one. Body warming powder I need to equip. Amplification pellets. Need to go bye bye. This needs to come on, and the these need to be replaced with these. All right, round four, I guess. Let's try it again. We're just running past you guys because I don't care about you right now. Nor do I care about. Um, can I run by you? I can. Fantastic. Here I come to wreck the day. Or should I say get wrecked? 
Okay. I need... Oh god. Wrong timing. Ah, ah fucking hell. Bitch. Oh, I'm frozen. Fuck. Oh, fucking hell. Okay, finally. Yagwai Chief, non-white. My god. What an insane fight that is. New Yagwai anecdote. Non-white. You're not a king, but you're a chief. All right. In the village of Tuolu, Tuoluo, Tuolo? I don't know. There was a small opera troupe of about a dozen members. Watching their performances was considered the most luxurious entertainment within miles. Among the troupe was an actor who specialized in playing the jester. He was always painted his face white, and the villagers would snicker whenever they saw him. The jester was deeply frustrated. Since childhood, he had dreamed of playing a heroic role on stage. To join the troupe, he had worked as an unpaid servant for the tr uh, troop leader for a year. He trained tirelessly, regardless of the weather or his health yet he ended up being the subject of ridicule. The jester suggested a role switch. However, everyone said he lacked the righteous aura needed for such a heroic role. Disbelieving their words, the jester took on the role of the hero without notifying the cast during the performance, and beat up the hero on stage. The audience was furious. They destroyed the stage and left without paying. The jester was condemned by the troop, while the beaten hero was comforted. In a fit of rage, the troop leader expelled the jester from the group. Despite much reflection, the jester couldn't understand why he suffered such reprimand. Eventually, he concluded that it was his appearance that was the problem. Thus, with two poisoned daggers, he wait, uh, waited in an alley and killed the hero actor. He peeled the man's face and wore it, hoping to take over his life. Jesus, okay. 
The next day, when it was time for the hero to appear on stage, the jester, wearing the actor's face, stepped forward and sang passionately. Initially, the audience was deceived, but later they were horrified. Believing the jester had gone mad, they tied him up and sent him to a temple a thousand miles away for, uh, for seclusion. Upon seeing him, the abbot of the temple was overjoyed. He named the jester non-white and even created a unique practicing technique combining poison and frost for him. The abbot told him that a destined one would come and help him master the technique and he could become a true hero if he could wear the face of the destined one. From that day on, no one dared to walk the mountain path guarded by non-white, fearing they might encounter him wearing on someone else's face. Hmm. Interesting. That's cool. What king did I not read about? Oh, I didn't read about her. Time to read. Despite Kang Jinlong's long wait, no constellation officer defended to her aid. Yellowbrow laughed. You young lady, your high opinion of yourself is precisely why you've ended up like this, an utter loser. Kang Jin Long replied, as long as I haven't begged for mercy, winning or losing is irrelevant. Not antagonized, Yellowbrow said calmly, you wouldn't take such a risk just for that look, uh, lookout cockerel. You must be curious about that monkey. Kang Jin Long remained silent. I do have something of that monkey's right here in this sack. With that, he untied a sack from his waist. Kang Jin Long recognized it as the sack that had once captured them and scoffed. What's so special about it? It's not like I haven't been in, in it before. Well, if you really want to know about him, you'll have to see for yourself. With that, Kang Jin Long was sucked into the sack. As she entered the sack, she seemed to see a ten-tailed goldfish swimming towards her. Not long after, when Yellowbrow released her, the constellation officer had become dazed and bewildered. Seeing this, Yellowbrow laughed heartily. Well, is he still the hero you remember? Kang Jin Long asked, Is he, along with all the gods and Buddhas in the celestial realm, all like this? Yellowbrow neither confirmed nor denied it. After a long while, Kang Jin Long suddenly knelt on the ground and uttered, Please, Master, accept me as your disciple. Mm. Long Maiden, Kang Jin Fair, White Horns by Emerald Sea, Ambition Beyond Mortal Care, Race Unmatched, Wild and Free, Black and White Entwine, Old Friends Hard to Find. Under wind's blade and frost cold blow, she dances still in swirling snow. Hmm. Okay. It's blood of the iron bulls. And now I have this thing. Non-white spirit. Another meditation point? Gonna skip the meditation scene. It's a whole lot of nothingness. Alright, well. That was a fight and a half. Here somewhere? Ah, oh, there he is. Take the form of non white, spin and leap to draw near the target in a flash, and sprout thorns all over the body to stab them. Moderately increases poison and frost damage. Hmm. Oh, well, shit. That is not what I meant to do. But I guess I don't have a choice at this point. Going all the way back down. Valley of Ecstasy. Okay.
And these places are just massive. Yes, I know you want me to go the other way. Oh, oh, okay, another frog. Well, we will go fight him in just a second. Let me go and rest at this thing really quick. Just so I have it to teleport to. And we'll rest, even though we don't really need to. Think I need anything else? Yeah, I picked up anything really. Ah, I can go down here. I was thinking I was going to be able to. Mm, let's go fight the frog first. The shimmering leaves is kind of funny to see. Alright, Frost Frog. I'm assuming that's what you're going to be. Do ice damage is my guess. Look at all the shimmering. I think that's... Uh, Artifacting, it looks like, maybe? Hello, froggy. Oh, Jesus. I locked him in the air. Oh, God. Okay, well, he was a lot easier than I thought. He's another Yagwai chief. Tadpole materials. Oh, I can't absorb his spirit, though. All right, journal time. Picking up from where we left off... <laughs> that Taoist, who had fled in disgrace, spent several years in secluded meditation in the mountains, mastering the five thunder techniques, until he could wield it with perfect ease. Confident in his abilities, he set out once more. During his journey, he captured a small electric tadpole and confined it within his gourd. As he passed th through the snowy mountains, the tadpole began to stir restlessly inside the gourd, signaling the presence of a frog guy nearby. Following the signs, he arrived at a deep, icy pool in a valley and indeed found a giant frog, covered in frost and lying dormant by the shore. Without hesitation, the Taoist unleashed a thunderbolt at the frog, expecting it to be struck down instantly. To his surprise, the frog leapt high into the air and dodged the attack. Unperturbed, the Taoist cast another thunderbolt, but the frog evaded it again, hopping closer with each leap. Learned from the past, the Taoist retreated several steps, thinking himself clever. However, to his surprise, the frog stood on its hind legs, puffed out its chest, lunged forward, and knocked the Taoist off, uh, off balance with its large belly. As he prepared to strike back, the frog opened his mouth and blew a gust of icy wind, freezing him in place. Just as the frog was about to devour him, a group of monks appeared on the other side of the pool. Seeing the Taoist frozen there, they drove the frog guai away, narrowly saving his life. Well... We didn't need some monks to help us. Did create some clones of ourselves. Of ourselves, but... Eh. Uh, 
feel like it's so easy to miss things in this game. I don't even know where I should go be going right now. <laughs> I love how they take a second to die. Oh god. You attacked fast. Excuse me. Don't do that again. Who the hell are you? Oh! Excuse me. The lesser Yagwai. Shooting frickin' lightning bolts at me, damn it. I think I'm getting lost. There's just so many areas to go. Ah! Jesus. Friggin' wrecked by basic enemies here. I think this is where I could have come down before, maybe? Looks like I can definitely jump down there, but I want to go around. Oh, hi. Excuse me. Thunder flame seal. What does that do? Considerably increases maximum stamina. Oh, so it's just another plus 30. Right? Considerably increases maximum... Oh, mana. <laughs> okay. Mm, plus 30, though. Is plus 30 worth it? Stamina recovery rate, rate would be pretty good. Oh, I could have put this on to fight that dude. Shit. I feel like it's just not worth it. What'd this thing do again? We're going to try it, that one. See if I like it or not. Wrong. Wrong button. Where was the next save point thing? 
Arrow, there it is. Yes, I hear you, enemies. It's also there's just so many places I can go. Unlock this for now. Oh, it's almost 11 o'clock. Holy shit. Didn't realize it was that late. Okay, now all the enemies have respawned that I already just killed, but that's okay. Um, let's go up to this temple. Alright, where is the other enemy? There you are. Oh! I didn't know you had ranged attacks. Remember that? Gotta gather all the shit so I can craft potions. Because clearly I'm going to need them. Looks like another mini boss fight. Mm. Non able. Oh, fuck. Holy shit. Ah. I yeah, I was going to say that was not the fin not the end. Oh. Fucking hell. Son of a bitch.
fucking kidding me? I have one hit away. One fucking hit. Are you kidding me right now? Bullshit. Man, I was doing so good, too. Hmm. Maybe I should use a damage reduction potion. In the chest. Money? <laughs> All right. Um, when the evil reigns, I'll cast it down. <laughs> Fuck. Ah, you son of a bitch. Able to able. Oh, fuck. Ah, son of a bitch. Son of a bitch.
Hmm. Okay. Well, that second fight went much better. All right. Blood of the Iron Bowl. More upgrade materials. Non able. It's a very interesting uh, enemy. Take the form of non able. Let loose a flurry of punches and kicks. Different phases of light attack enable different moves. Ah, okay, so when you're in different phases of your light attack, and you hit these buttons. Interesting. Sudden increases attack, critical hit chance, and critical hit damage, but massively reduces max mana. Oh. Well, I don't really care for that now, do I? Uh, okay. Which way to go from here? Up and around? Probably not. I don't think we can do anything up here. Ooh, what do we got? Oh. Some fire bell flowers. I don't think we can actually do anything up here. Stupid worm things. There's somebody down there. Oh, is that the, um, is that our friend? Ah, God damn you. I guess I'm supposed to go down. I think I've covered everything up here. Maybe not. I don't really know, though. Mm. Crafting, brewing. Store, I can sell some stuff. Um, is there anything to buy? Reignite sparks. Cultivate. Okay. You, I need not avoidness. Didn't I get one of those? Oh no, I spent one already. Mm. Take the form of enslaved Yaksha. Swing a long blade to stab the foe in the heart. This can stagger them for a moment. Grants a moderate amount of focus. He is pretty cool. Non-white. Poison and frost damage, which I don't do any poison or frost damage right now, so... It's whatever. Hmm. Was uh your attack will be enhanced. Frosty wind. Frost damage, heavy attack damage, poison damage and poison resistance. Rat to Gubna. I don't. 
Are the blood of the iron bulls only used on this? I don't remember. Um, but I also have points to spend. Four to be exact. Moon Rome. What is this under? Transformations? Scorch damage. Slightly increases the damage dealt by duplicates when using another spell. This seems really good. Is having more really useful though? Also, what does this do again? Increases the duration. They already last a decent amount of time. Um, alteration, cloud step. Increases the health, increases the movement speed. Oh, interesting. Extends the duration. Wait, when hit? Oh, so when they attack the decoy? Oh, interesting. Considerably increases the damage. I mean, eh? Ring of fiber. Ooh, immobilize. Consumes a moderate amount of additional mana to. Yeah, 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 yeah. I could just max this out, I guess. But I don't know if it's really worth spending the points on that. I still have one point to spend. And I can have four points, correct? Mm hmm. Um. Oh, yeah. How do I do this again? After performing a tactical retreat, a forceful thrust, or a charged heavy attack, Hold light attack to unleash uh, whirling thrusts. I'll have to do that at some point. Conforming a tactical retreat with the enemy seen through, executing another heavy attack initiates forceful thrust. Uh, what the hell is forceful thrust again? Ah. Following light attack with heavy attack performs a tactical retreat. The decimal hops back and, and hones his defense so preparing for another fierce attack. Following... Tactical retreat with another heavy attack that consumes a focus point unleashes forceful thrust. Okay, so perform after a pump with enemy seen through, executing another heavy attack in shades. Hmm. Exempts all stamina cost of a short duration upon seeing through the enemy. Seems pretty good. So in order to do this, I have to do a tactical retreat, a forceful thrust, or a charged heavy attack. And if I just hold light attack afterwards, it will do it. I'm trying to remember all these freaking things. I'm not sure it's gonna happen, but we're gonna try. 
All right, now how do I get down there? Oh, I can just wander down right here. Oh, hi. I forgot you were here. Bing, bang, boom. Leave me alone. Who are you? And what are you doing down here? I guess before I fight you, I'm going to run back up this way to see what's up here. Another celestial pair. Ooh, another one up here. Okay, so it was just a bunch of celestial pairs, it looks like. And some frogs I haven't fought in a long time. Oh, they explode, I forget. Damn it. Jade Lotus. Okay, so we just get some materials. That's always good, though. Dance am I in? Guess it doesn't matter. Uh, you're probably invincible, aren't you? Uh. Okay, well, I almost died. Whoops. Another spirit? Crow Diviner. Well, he wasn't as bad as I thought he was going to be, but annoying nonetheless. Sir. Yeah. You better go away. Uh, some more frogs. Hi. <laughs> oh. Oh. Holy shit. Didn't realize how low I was. Bye -bye. Right. Um. Okay. Guess we're going down, huh? Uh. 
Uh, there wasn't anything back here, right? Doesn't look like it. Guess we're going down. Oh boy. Well, we're about to find out if we're going to get wrecked or not. Oh, another save point. Great. I think we may just end here, honestly. We've been going for about two hours, and I'm honestly getting fairly tired. It is 11.15 p.m. for me. And I unfortunately do need to get up in the morning. Not super early, but I do have a few things I need to get done in the morning. So I think I might cut this one a little short. Although I am intrigued to see what this is. I think this is going to be a fight. Or not. Huh. What the hell is this area then? Okay, so clearly there's something that I haven't accomplished yet. To activate whatever is supposed to be going on here. Hmm. Okay, well, I guess that pretty much speaks for that. Can't jump off the edge there, so I guess we're just going to end it here then, because there is nothing else for me to do right here. So, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this shorter stream, and I will hopefully be picking back up again, maybe on... Tuesday? It'll probably be sometime in the morning, maybe on Tuesday. So it'll be like, I don't know. I can't guarantee anything. Because I'm not sure if I'm going to record that morning or if I'm going to go live. But I've got, or I'm going to see a movie in the afternoon uh, with some friends. So probably won't be that night because i think i have to get up relatively early wednesday morning so regardless i will probably go live tuesday at some point hopefully if not i'll post somewhere and let you know but anyway hopefully enjoyed this one we'll catch you in the next one have a great rest of your day